consider your position and plan accordingly. Um, trade route, more hoarder locations, more creature dens, oases, and field hospitals. This is a better option for us. We have Modern a really good rain. team for taking on the general too, if we wanted to take on an early death. general. On. This land um, is truly barren. Swag, you can only be Audrey. So. Enjoy. Uh, all right. Each improvement, a new variable. Yeah, so we're going to go for the general. Fate. I mean, we might not fight the general, but. Creature Dan, Oasis Scouting Location. I don't necessarily care about this. Um, the only thing I'm, I might want to consider taking the Shrieker trick and going for the Scouting Gear because it does increase our crit chance and critting with Blights is going to be really... It's going to be really nice if we're going to be landing a lot of them. I'm not super worried about the healing. Um, we do have the medical one. We could create poultices and stuff. Like, this is not a good item per se, but it will increase our crit chance, which is also good. And also we get more baubles, which is nice. Um... Sure, let's go for it. Let's see if we can. Let's see how effective we can make this work for us. I don't generally go for this pet because it's kind of me, kind of mad. But I mean, increasing your crit chance is not a bad time. Psycho, I really think the game is rigged against you, man. And I, I don't think, I don't know why. I do not know why. All right, Needler is going to be one that we definitely want to get rid of. But let's try to get Something our food up first. The of the road. Um, I'm going to try to get rid of Needler. Okay, that's good. Now, Nervous would also be a good one to get rid of. It does give us additional speed. Um, the stress we can probably manage. I wouldn't think it's that big of a deal, if I'm entirely honest. Um, I need to turn off those timers, because we're no longer... Act Why? Oh, okay. <laughs> my, bot is, my bot is just all, all up on itself. One sec, let me close down this. Uh, unenable. All right, there we go. All right. Uh, did I not feed somebody? No, everybody got fed. I bought additional food. I did not need to Conventional buy. Conventional fare, but fairly priced. Um, we can afford a trinket if we wanted to, because we bought a cheaper item. Speed debuff resists. Um. Disease resist, debuff resist. Sure, I'll take this. This can be pretty useful. Um, just to stop her from getting like blinds and stuff, which we definitely don't want landing. Now for mastery Experience. points, I'm going to go for bolster. And I'm going to go for uh, flashing all. daggers. Because this is a really good additional blight to add to our group. Um, and that bumps us up to like four blight with that. And I think that's good. I don't really want to take on too much else. We do have a hospital coming up, or we will have that we'll have scouted hospitals. And we have additional hospitals, so. If we can get to the general in good condition, we'll take him on. With the combination of acid rain and plague grenade, we should be able to just like ruin him. War. Rewards. Only resignation. We have to go to the lair no matter what. There is a creature den, but I'm feeling like we can take this money to the hospital for greater effect. That being said, do we need any? Do we need to get rid of anything? I mean, nervous, winded, weak grip. Honestly, maybe not. Maybe a regular fight is a better option for us. Gives us some loot, potentially a trinket. A creature den right before a. A layer I'm a little skeptical of, especially this early on. Hey, praise the sun. The den for sure. See, I'm skeptical of it because it's... Uh, I don't want to set us up for failure, especially this early on. We have a pretty squishy team, even for blight resistance. We're not going to be able to cure any... Or we're going to be able to cure a little bit of the blight, but... If we run into quad spiders, we could be in a pretty sticky situation. I think if we get the general now, we'll feel better. And it'll set us up for getting the... Uh, the lost <laughs> That's a fun one. Double crit and on. strength token. It'll set us up for the uh, potentially getting a collector. What kind of spiders? Not the kind you want. Uh, 
Now, this is of course assuming they don't just get every blight resist in the world. So yeah, once we get our blight abilities upgraded, Measure we're already doing items. like pretty and ridiculous. Oh, okay, thanks for the crit there, buddy. I appreciate that. Already doing very good blight damage right now. This is no mm. time to falter. Yeah, that's nervous already doing its work there. Uh, he's dead, so... Right? Yeah, he's dead, so let's just... Honestly, though, Flashing Daggers is the better option because it does more Blight. So, probably should have just done that. I kind of always forget that it... Oh my god, that's two crits in this fight already. Seriously, the last couple days have just been crazy with the crits. I'll take that. Uh, it can't bolster. We'll just smack him in the face. Just keep smacking him in the face. All right. Good 26 heal there. Just keep his health up. So what, Bate? What are we sowing? Right. Yeah, that was a rough fight. Sweet reprieve. Who Until makes the them? Uh, technically, you. it's me that does. Hey, already has it going. Like it's my it creates a clip using my account. I got a lurk out of stew stuff. No worries, Lardy. Thank you very much for hanging out. Appreciate the lurk, my friend. Um. Mm, I don't like the debuff to healing, but the additional crit is gonna be nice right now. That gives her like an additional 5% crit already with everything we've got going on. Just chilling on my 107,000. Y'all y'all have too many damn points, so we need to do like a purge soon. Get everybody's points up. All right, do we have any items? We have no items. All right, that's fine. We should be able to handle this fight. We just may come out of it pretty stressed. What awaits you inside. Just depends on um how these first couple Within fights go, region, honestly. A general and his loyal lumbering guard different points though Pate. different points Stupendous. malaise measured and steady hey blaze of fox doing well how about yourself welcome on in You are a broke fisherman. You are the most broke out of everybody. It's kind of crazy. This is going to sting. Yeah. Doing good. Glad to hear it. No, there hasn't been leaks. I'm just I'm just messing around. No leaks that I'm aware of. <sighs> But I'm a, I'm actually a playtester for the game, so I can't leak anything, even if I could. Come on, what is up with the crits these last couple days, man? This is this is fucking gnarly, dude. Come on, video game. All right. Of course, everybody is below thresholds, which is just lovely. Do the Dismiss Raynal combo again. First person to get them in love is gonna, like, break Reddit. Ah, I was hoping we can get the kill there. Alright. The enemy weakens and wanes. Unfortunate that nobody is at stress threshold right now. We can at least get the stress down, but we can't. So. A simple variable. 
got the skills it seem have i oh yeah the pp poopy man that's that's a rare boss probably should have necrosis there if he didn't if i could have oh oh well oh well it's fine uh this is gonna we're gonna get stressed here At least we're at stress threshold now, so we can at least reduce his stress a little bit, which is good. Oh, that was not the ability I wanted to use. Whoops. Okay. Now we're at too much stress. That was a misclick. I meant to use flashing daggers there. Oh, well. Got to love the misclicks. Yeah, absolutely love when that happens. Oh, well. Life goes on. The man arms will survive. Yeah, once we get the blight abilities upgraded with this team, uh, the numbers start just getting out of hand very quickly. A breakthrough. We now have blight on everybody, so we can do necrosis here for a fat heal. Uh, we can't bolster here. Uh, no, I'm actually just going to stand fast. I'm going to force the damage in him. And potentially the stress, too. These guys have a fairly weird... Does not offer... No, you can't edit times, no. You can't crop the beginning and end of it. You'd have to go to the VOD and remake a clip, unfortunately. They are adding that functionality in. It's just not in the, in the system yet. Uh, can we glint anything to death here? There's a chance we can, yeah, glint it to death. Alas, no such luck. But now it's pretty much dead. Get that stress down. Now we're feeling a lot more managed, which is good. Doesn't really matter what he does here. We can just necrosis to hit everybody. I'm assuming we can kill him before. Oh, man, that sucks. I That was a misplay. So the drummer gets another turn. I kind of keep forgetting that the uh, the drummer's free action doesn't count as one of his turns. I can't I can't kill him here. Um, he's actually going to live and he's going to do death before dishonor. So everybody gets a little stressed. That was a bad. That was a pretty rough misplay. That is potentially going to cause me some issues. Ugh, annotated. Man, this is rough, dude. What a crap hole. Footman's Grog, Insi Insignia, which only gives us a little bit of block. And Annotated Textbook, which is going to do pretty much nothing for us. We could potentially get additional healing given, which can be good. But that's, I mean, that's like the one of the worst holes you can get from this. Footman's Grog is an absolute nightmare of a trinket. It, like it. It, it's good. It's just not very good, in my opinion. But it is what it is. It used to be so much. I think it's just because it used to be so much better. I can't even remember what it used to do, but I know it used to be better. Locked in a nightmare slumber. Everybody's got bad luck with the game, I feel like. I haven't won fishing in a while. Hello. Hey, Albor. Thank you very much for the hello, follow. Hello, hello. Welcome on in. Good to have you here. Hope you're doing well. Okay, now the problem with this fight is going to be if he just starts resisting every blight that lands on him, we're going to have issues. The fiend's strength dwindles. Um, you know what? I'm just going to bolster. We're going to get that stress down now before it does become a problem. He's going to do unsettling, but there's not much I can do about that. We're probably going to get a meltdown in this fight. That's not guaranteed, but it, it's likely. Um. Okay, up to 10 blight there. 12 blight. Fifteen. I'm 
something whispers twice on the grave robber. Thank you. Very good. Uh, we can stand fast here. At least try to spread some of that stress. Nineteen. Still 19. He resisted it there, unfortunately. Okay, 22 damage there. Not bad. Yeah, it's a long cleanup. It's just to stop people from spamming that command. Bolster here. Um, we could sepsis, but I'm not going to. It's not enough damage, really, for me to want to do it quite yet. Um, so, oh, I can't even do cause of death from back here. I don't know why. I, I need to take that off. Resisted the blight there, unfortunately. Yeah, it will be a problem if he continuously resists uh, blights. That's going to cause us issues. 23. Yeah, that's gonna hurt. The enemy weakens and wanes. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Um. All right. So we didn't pull all the tap root there. Gonna have to hope we can hit up somebody else. This fight is not going the way I wanted it to go. Of course, a creeping growths on flag. It's fine. He's next, though. It's unlikely I would be able to. Um, he's just gonna have to do his thing. It's unlikely that it would put, pull the root on him. Hit this boss is really not that bad. I just, I'm just taking it way too early. Of course I crit. <laughs> For who knows what That's just unfortunate. If you get it, if you let him get to like pat like round seven and eight, like that's where you're really gonna start seeing issues with this fight. Um, we let it, we've let it go way too long, unfortunately. The greatest. Just resolute. Ah, oh well. If we'd upgraded the Blight skills, we wouldn't really be in this predicament. That's one of the other issues we've done here. We didn't upgrade the Blight skills, we would have had way more damage going into him. He's taking, he's hitting Death's Door next round, so that's good. Um, we can just defend her probably over here. Hey, Darkness has a gun. And if Flag goes Meltdown, it's like, it's whatever. It's non-issue non to me. But deadly all the same. He's just gonna go toxic. We're just gonna have to salvage our relationships out of this, which sucks, but it is what it is. It's just kind of part of taking this fight early on. Hey, Mariner, how's it going, man? How you doing, bud? Alright. I'm gonna need man arms to resolute here. Easy. Just like I said. It's easy if you just resolute all the time. The 
enemy I hate that that ability wins. gives stress to other heroes. I never understood that. And you, even if you ignore it, even if you dodge it, resist it, whatever the case, like, whatever if he misses, doesn't matter. He still gets the stress to the other heroes. Which is just super fun for everybody involved. We're gonna probably have another meltdown. There we go. Okay, we're coming out of it alive. That's all that matters. We are the flame. All that for Burning subpar loot, for too. To see. <laughs> uh, that's what we get for taking a region one early node. Very unfortunate there. Is what it is. Um, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, this loot is pretty, like, gross, and our relationships are now trash. Seven, seven, eight, those are fine, that's fine. Yeah, all of Damien's are gonna be utter trash. Okay, that's fine. Nothing too bad about it. Another creature, I think we just go take a creature, go take a fight, fight, and then a Kyrogen's table. That should be easy, right? That's what we wanna see right now. Uh, we should probably go for this watchtower. Gives us some time to heal. Thoughts on Courageous Abandon? I think it's a decent ability that's overshadowed by him having better abilities. I think, yeah, I think the main issue with Courageous Abandon is not that it's Courageous Abandon. I think, or like that it's terrible. I think it's just, it's a good ability. It's just he has better buttons to hit. And that's that's really what it boils down to. You need to it just it just takes too much setup. I mean, you can run it with like a Vestal um, and have uh, her consecrations generate the block tokens. And like that can be like a semi decent way to um, kind of get that rolling. It's worth running with the 50% crit trinket or no. Is it worth running? Uh, that, that's a hard definition. I don't know if it's worth running. I think it. You can make it work. But again, I think I don't. I don't know if it would really do much for you. Intended to. Yeah, it's likely to crit. Thank you. Again, it's, you know, is that setup worth it? I mean, that's kind of the question at the end of the day. I don't want to hit the repost, so, um. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. A promising development. Thank you. I'm going to take that. Nice. Very lucky with that heal. Guard from full armor would be kind of like a, a ghetto point blank shot. I mean, that's kind of what it's made to be, right? But the thing about it is, yeah, you have you have to go through without getting the uh, without having any. But he consumed the block tokens, right? Which is much easier said than done. I'll take that as well. Thank you. All right. Uh, you can get rid of those guard tokens. You don't need them anymore. All right. We've managed to clean this up pretty effectively. Lenity. Grace. Small act that drive back the darkness. My hope is that we do see Collector at, at one point. I'd really like to get this. Oh. Misclick. Would like to get Collector's, um, not Collector's head. Frickin' uh, Dismiss's head would be a good find for us on this team. Scavenge what you can and be sure. off once more. Unlikely the Grey Robber is going to go first, but we'll see. All right, do I want to take on a creature den? That's gonna be a tough. It's gonna be a tough one for us after what we just went through. 
And we really only get one mastery point from that lair. How do mastery how do lairs not just automatically get two? That's such a weird Resign. I mean I know you already get things. I guess the idea is that you already get a bunch of death. stuff from it, so it's like you don't need the I'm mastery points on top of it, wait. but um yeah I do. Fuck you video game. Alright, what's the status here? Everybody wants to run. In all honesty, we should probably run. This will affect our relationships, though, but it's fine. It'll help one hurt the other. The loathing whispers. I think right now we're in a little bit of dire straits. We just kind of want to try to repair. Oh, please tell me we don't have to do a repair fight. Yeah, we do not have to do a repair fight. Memories of a dream. A sanctum of we're not going to get anything good from memories awaits. of a dream. We could get a quirk. I should say, like, we can't get a quirk from academic studies. If you don't like the, the curio, and you don't want to interact with the curio, you almost always will have an interaction that'll give you a quirk. So if you don't care for the item, you can at least get something something decent out of it if you're lucky. Alright, let's take the uh let's take the combat item. Or forgotten. It is ours now. I'm gonna split this. Get two stacks of two. Mariner, are you excited for the uh, DLC? Any thoughts on it? The loathing festers. Does anybody have any thoughts on the DLC? What are you all excited for about it? A place of research and inquiry. One crusader, please. I think that's. I think that's the consensus. What? career. Uh, that's it. That's an interesting one. So you'll get a buff from this, but it doesn't actually tell you what the buff is. You don't even get it in the character sheet, which is interesting, to say the least. I'll take that. Cosmic Hater. Yeah, I'll take that. Sure, more damage and less damage taken from Cosmic. Still thinking Duelist might have a skill do repost. And of course, it does say in, in her description on the Steam store that she does do repost, so I'm, I'm guaranteeing that she'll do some repost. Imagine the runaway had to kind of be funneled into a burn character and that kind of handcuffed the creativity. So I'm really curious to see how creative they get with a hero that doesn't have to be handcuffed. You mean the duelist? Yeah. Big buff boy with big sword. Yeah, I'm hopeful that one of them, my assumption is that Reynold will have some sort of like holy it does say something about holy fire in his description this is a this is a mash jesus christ um and i'm hopeful that he does have some like sort of burn synergies because we're definitely lacking on those in the game right now like we only have the one hero that does any so like reliably at least and a lot of resistances there that I did not want to see. I'm going to take this in preparation for what's about to happen to me. Um, we're about to take This is about to be not fun. Magnesium Rain Erasure. That's true. I guess, I guess Plague Doctor is also a semi-burn here. I just... They really were like... When they started the game development and they were like releasing information about dd2 very early on they were really excited about burn like that was something that they were super like they were like oh we've added a new dot to the game it's gonna have like its unique kind of feel and stuff like that and i don't know it does, like burn does have some interesting like can kind of spread and I, I do enjoy that but they need to they need to do more of it The work continues. So I'm hopeful that they've got... Oh my god, the crits, man. Triggers for burn are super good, but yeah, there's not all the ways to, like, use it. Like, the Vestal can do a decent, uh, like, bit of burn, but it takes so much setup to, like, make happen. Um, that, again, it, it, she, she falls prey to me being like, I have other buttons I can hit right now that are going to do more for me. Why would I hit that button? And that button isn't going to do anything for me when this one's going to do more. And I think that's the biggest problem. Yeah, like the tokens of like, OK, I can burn somebody for three or I can heal a fellow hero for like a crap ton. Like, yeah, I'm going to. What do you think I'm going to take? 
sweet reprieve until the next test is put before you. Sure. That's going to be pretty useful on Flag, actually. Anything that helps him with his self-heals is going to be really, really good on him. All right. Well, this team has not taken off quite yet, but once we get the Blight abilities upgraded, I think we'll really start to feel how powerful this team can be. All the DBR lowering, though, is definitely not a fun thing to have going on. The enemy weakens. The constant blight resists have also been pretty annoying. Surprising, because it's generally I generally don't see that many blight resists happen. I've been getting a lot of them. Uh, I'm just gonna shove this one back. Good crit, holy crap. And that'll at least disrupt him. A slow dissection. An unavoidable enemy. Make it harder for them to just land a crap ton of bleeding damage into us right away. Disruption with cultists is like the quintessential way to deal with them. They deal so much less stress and damage if they're out of position. Ah. Right, we're on act three. I was like, something something ain't adding up here. Nocturne Commune was not the smartest idea there, but okay. AI doing AI things. Also, we're just going to shove this one back again, so it can't do its big bleed attack while also critting. Get me locked up in a padded room. Yeah, they're pretty, they're pretty blatantly annoying. That's for sure. Definitely hope we can get some more scouting gear so we can increase our crit. Um, even more because landing crit blights is gonna be huge for this team I should have really be doing the damage to this one to just stop it from even getting a turn But this four damage would have been doable for me, but now we're gonna have to take a crit So, Oops. yourself Every once in a while. Yeah, I mean yeah, it really it really does have its moments, right? But I guess that's kind of the point that is the point ah there we go Hmm Calculation, perhaps. No, we don't even get the heal. No. Oh my God. This wound, at least. I wonder if the crit to. from the uh, crit from the pet applies to medic uh, healing crits, which usually <sighs> crit amplifiers do not. But no. How did we resist stress there? Does he have, is he have a memory for stress resist? Yeah, okay. Hey, I saw as a gun. I don't believe they do, no. Usually healing crits are separate, but I, I'm happy to be corrected on that if I'm wrong. Blight resist, um, sure. 100% resistance to Blight. Take it. My shirt, by the way. Thank you. I'm really feeling my oh, 90s cup era. My 90s paper cup era. I wore this shirt to uh, TwitchCon 2019. My first TwitchCon. So I thought it'd be really funny. I cannot tell you how many fucking people I ran into wearing this pattern on different things. I ran into, like probably a dozen people a day who were also wearing this print um and like they're like oh my god you're wearing it too oh my god i was like i don't have a single creative thought in my mind familiar nonetheless all right where are we going every road a winding torment every turn bent on our destruction we have a hundred and four baubles conventional fair but fairly priced at least you're a part of the hive mind with good ideas though yep 
hive mind hive mind here we want scouting gear even though this does nothing for us like in all reality it does give us Your an additional two percent crit if it is to carry you which is good you road go. gear sure we'll take two get our trinket prices lowered um He's already going last, right? Yay! You caught me in distress. Good job, Artie. GG. I'm dropping medicinal textbook. It doesn't really do anything for us. Uh, I have to keep some of the baubles because we will need to repair after going through the Seleuce. Um, that being said, we can get our Blight Resist up here to just help everybody be... Banana suit while in distress. I'm always Where wearing a banana suit. It's just camouflage right now. That you may stand just a little taller at the end. Um, all right. I can use Calls of Death, right? I, I, I keep forgetting it can't be used from rank four. Um, sure, why not? We'll ounce. Who knows? Ounce might be useful for once. Ounce is, is a very useful ability, but I'm just not feeling it right now. Uh, play grenade and probably IS. We still have a lot of money. Oh, you know what we're going to need to fix? Uh, we're not going to be able to. I kind of forgot about this, but our relationships are absolutely tanked right now, right? So where can we, where can we, if anywhere, help people? Swan and Swag. We at least get you guys out of 66 to 33%, which is much more manageable. I don't think I can get anybody else out of a threshold, unless we are really lucky, like Swag and Damien. Maybe we get it to... Do we have... We don't have any poetry. We do have songbooks of amorous ballads, which, you know, Something could be pretty good for us. The of the road. Um, Swan and Swag. Hopefully you guys fall in love. There we go. I got them closer. Unfortunately, did not take them all the way. Percentages are in tiers instead of each point having a value, if that makes sense. Do I like that they're in tiers instead of... Oh, so, like, are you saying that, like, each pip would be, like, you know, 100, 90, 80, 70, 60, 50, 40? Uh, I think it adds... I think it's good. I mean, it's basically... I can see what you're saying, though, because then at least every time you move the pips, you're you're doing something like you're actually making a change instead of it having to be you have to move it like five pips at a time or four pips or whatever it is. Um, honestly, it's not something I've really thought about before. I kind of like the idea of each pip being an amount. Maybe maybe not within neutral maybe neutral could be still the block of like five percent to five percent but then it's like different layers of guaranteed as you go up um because like yeah it does to me that like it's still rng but at least that way every time like i'm using whiskey i am making a difference i don't have to collect i would feel better about using a single whiskey instead of like trying to hoard like 10 of them or something um, that's actually honestly not a bad idea. I'd put that in the Discord, man. I'd see how people feel about it. I, I wouldn't be against that kind of being a a thing. Again, we're going to spend all the money here. Damien Barriston. Fall in I can't use that on you, so good thing we know that. Okay, Swan and Damien. Okay, oh, now you're melophobic. God damn it. Okay, so now it's just Damien and Swag. Oh, you're also melophobic. All right. Sorry, Damien. Nobody likes music. Everybody's fucking melophobic. All right, whatever. Fuck it. We're all having bad relationships. We're having a bad time. Let's go. Home now, they're far worse than rats. Only one? I'm fine with that. It's, yeah, almost everybody is. Punish and hold the line. Honestly, punish giving taunt to my tank is really not an issue. 
And we just take off Crush, because I'm not really using it. One thing I put in the Discord is the bug in this patch, the Vestal shines yellow. Yeah, it. a lot of people kind of, like, unironically liked it. Quickly. Of course, it's going to get taken out, this but... Is swine um, it is funny. All right. Oi, oi, oi. Uh, hero goal complete. Nobody cares. Go away. It's a sluice. I can't use my map anyway. All right. Left. The unknown awaits. Be we have a pretty decent chance of running into a Kyrogen stable in here. I'm not going to lie. They're fairly common in these. Which, I mean, we don't really need it, but, like, I wouldn't say no to it. Oh, we should make sure that Annie Venom is actually equipped on somebody, huh? Fight? Fight. We advance! Alright. Here, piggy, 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 here, piggy, piggy, piggy. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Cooperation is the key. Hey, Zeus, how's it going? Stumbling and stupefying. Yeah, I'll take the bleed resist. I'm not going to lie. That's pretty good. Let's defend. No, not defender. Let's uh, stand fast. Breacher decisions going into a fight gives a strength token. Even though Breacher already starts you at two and you can't do it. Yeah, yeah, it's it's an odd one. You're an odd one, Mr. Grinch. Just got to lurk today. Got some work to do. No worries, my friend. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. Hope your work goes well. Nice sentiment, though. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's nice. It's nice. I forget that Glenn ignores stealth. I should be better, do better, are better. I'm living for these crits right now. At four percent now, we're getting from the stagecoach is making a difference. So it's, it's a small difference, but it is there. Landing crit blights is is huge. Like, threats await those who dare. Especially if we can land a few against the final boss. The loathing. Of the hope base. against the boss is that we don't lose everybody. <laughs> that's pretty much that's pretty much my only hope right now. Or that we get some scene tokens on Audrey and we can stealth her up somehow. I might need to throw on Shadow Fade or something. Gold. I'm drowning in gold. I wonder if they'll have some, like, reference to, uh, if it is Reynold, which I'm assuming it is, his, um, kleptomania. I'm gonna grab, uh, another drink. I'll be right back.
Sorry, I took on a side quest. All right. What are we doing? Run, run, fight. I guess we'll run. Work in those relationships, back up. Well, I got some snacks, but I also got my girlfriend to drink. That was that was the real side quest. The this ghost pepper gummy worms. No, I I refuse. These rancorous beasts have some demonic. I absolutely refuse. Also, what is this song? This is like way too trancy for me right now. I need um. Let's see, maybe we get something a little bit more upbeat. Alright. Fight, fight, fight. I'm about to try one. Good luck, my friend. Worms! Everybody do the worm. Look, I'm dancing. Is this dancing? Insert butterfly meme here. Yeah, the blight resists here are gonna be a lot. What are these guys natural blight resist? 40? Yeah, it's gonna be... We're gonna have a little bit of blight resist, right? Huh? Oh, that's not acid rain. I was like, that's... Why is it not doing the thing? Because it's not the thing. Somebody's gonna eat that corpse. Yeah. Hey, Giuliano, 15 to 60 more days. Must I wait more for Crusader? I mean, we don't know if it's coming out at the beginning or the end of December either, so you might have to wait longer than that. They haven't given us a date, just a month. I would assume that it would be it would be earlier, but. There is beauty in our imperfections. Sorry, let's just look at something. That one is dead. Now I made a corpse for him. Yay, that was smart. Give us more teasing. I hope they do. I love Red Hook, man, but they are... I don't think they're the best at, like, PR. Um, I feel like they have a lot of waste opportunities with PR and stuff. Like, assuming that it's coming out in December, like, we don't have to assume. We... We kind of know it is, right? Or at least that's what they're telling us. I would imagine they have a lot of it done. Um, and ready to go. So, like, they should be doing, like, promos and stuff. Build a PR for it. Well, that's the thing, like, I don't know. It's something that... Me and other creators have talked to Red Hook about and stuff, and it, and yeah, it's just upsetting at times when there's so much potential and it kind of gets like, bleh. Ever heard me tell the story of the emails? Yes, yes, you did. You have told me that story. Um, you know, they've done some stuff, like, we, you know, I've, I've streamed for them and things on the Steam page and whatnot. Um, but I, like, I would love to, like, I don't even care if it's me. Like, I just want the game to do really well. Like, I, because it does, that helps me. But even stuff like, hey, let's get, like, a, one of the larger streamers, like, Shuffle or Bear or... I doubt they could get Baru, because Baru is, like, massive. Um, and stuff, like they could be like hey can you stream to our store page or not to the store page even to the twitch the channel oh i forget we still have a second wave learned. yeah i mean dd1 was very popular in the like and i i think that they've they've lost that momentum they would probably have some and i'm not a professional marketer but i have done marketing for streams for a very long time 
I think they would get, um, they're gonna get a lot of value out of this DLC, especially with the Crusader being in it. There, There is like place on Twitch for it. Like they could definitely utilize Twitch. And their streams do get a lot of viewers. Like it, when they do do their development streams, they get like Malays. over a thousand viewers sometimes. And steady. Um, but they never really did like a creator program or anything like that. I was really hoping they would with DD2. Um, I mean, they, like, uh, don't get me wrong, they've been really good to me. Like I, like Bate said, I've got like a signed poster from the team. I've gotten merch from the team. I've gotten you know pins and all sorts of stuff, and they've I've gotten a lot of opportunity through them, and I really appreciate that. But I think they could have done a lot with it, um, and I hope that they they will do a lot with it. But the longer they wait, the longer it's going to be not. A, they're just not going to be able to do anything with it. Yeah, I was on the Steam page for you know with like couple thousand viewers at one point and stuff. It was very cool. Um, feels like a really low ratio. Yeah, there it is. It's it's a it's a low ratio. The DD2 is not doing well on Twitch. But again, I think a lot of it was like it was doing well for a while when they had like the larger creators and stuff playing the game. Steady um, but it's died off. The momentum is no longer there. It'd be really hard to get it back at this point. Not impossible, but it'd be tough. I'm hoping this DLC brings some much needed love back into the community for the game. With uh with with Ray Ray coming back, I think a lot of people will really jump into it. But again, they have to leverage that, right? Mark, you can't let the momentum of something like that pass. Like, and even just like getting the hype going, like they, like they're really good at certain things. Like the hype that they've generated for the Crusader. <laughs> hey, Faye. Wow, the hype that they've generated for the Crusader just through the artwork that they've dropped for him over all the time is like it's crazy. You know, like that hype that they generate, like that. Sorry, turtle, it's broken. I need to. I need to. I'm gonna turn it off. One sec. I'm sorry. I, I fixed it, then it broke. Then I, I, I think we're just done with it at this point. The uh, the flashbang, it just makes me sad. <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna disable that. I don't know what's up with it. Those teas are unhinged. I love them. Yeah. This game gets more recognition, becomes more popular, gets more updates. Yeah, I mean, obviously, the more people that, that buy DLC or play the game, whatever, is going to give them more funding to do stuff with. Um, and I really, I want the long-term success for the game because it's what my channel is built on and stuff. It's making me cry, and I said, "Pictures, oh my god, be careful, turtle, don't hurt yourself, you lunatic." Um, and yeah, like they have the potential to do a lot of stuff like that. I'm really hoping over the next week or two we get to see some like teasing from their team. You know, like even like when they released the flag, right? That poster they had with the hand, like the conversations that that started were people fighting over is it abomination? Is it flag? Is it um is it is it a gaunt character? Is it somebody we've never seen before, but it's blight, but it's flag. It's like, "Oh, but like like all that stuff was like that was great. Like, people were, like, freaking out about it. It was so good. Um, Death Seeker. Can't remember what that does. Something about being on Death's Door. Yeah, it's not good. <laughs> Turtle, that's... You're ridiculous, man. Don't hurt yourself, bud. Mind your wheels. Oh, we're out of... We may have a repair fight. We should make sure that we have everything equipped that we can. I cannot see where we're going. You're seeking who? Yeah. There's power in the blood for those in fortitude to pay the price. Now it's the blight. There's power in the blight. Oh, uh, I, I love the person who edited that photo to be uh, purple. And it was like, there is power in the lean <laughs> for those willing to pay the price. Like, oh my god. What the fuck? Winded lets us fight, but it gives us weakness to start with. That's a rare one. I don't see that one very often. Um, excuse me. Excuse, excuse me, sir. 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 
This is this is a no cat zone. You are not supposed to be up here. Excuse, excuse me, excuse me. That's my staple. That's my staple. That's my staple. Okay, buddy. No, you need to go now. It's my stapler. I'm gonna just gonna gonna go. I'm gonna burn the whole place down. We examine it, enjoyers. Yes, we are. We're enjoying examining it today. Bravo. No, I want to blight on the whole team just to get funny necrosis value. The enemy get weakens led. and wanes. You weaken and wane, Wayne. Yeah, the additional crit is now starting to kind of come into play a lot. Yeah. All right. Dead, dead, the and also dead. Variable can make all the difference. Greater threats await those who dare. Oh, distracting dust. Yeah, it's probably better than crit. Or maybe even better than insignia. Uh, I'll take it over insignia. I kind of like the crit right now. We'll take it, but because we, we have the additional crit already, so every percentage is really going to help us out. Just getting those. Landing those crit blights over and over and over and over and over and over again. I'm a, I, it's amazing how we've done this. We've managed to go through three wheels and only one of our additional armor. And we can't if I can't see anything, it's probably going to be a, like if there's nothing on the road, that probably means. Oh, no, we're safe. OK, that's close, though. Rest tonight. Under the mountains. Oh, we got Cosmic Slayer days. on Swagger. That's really good. That's going to be very good, especially against the Consider final boss. Position. Might want to try locking that in if we can find a hospital. That's worth it. All right, let's take a look at our relationships. Okay, we've we've gotten a lot of them up, but unfortunately, I think everybody's still fucking melophobic, right? So I can't do anything with them. Yeah, that's just useless at this point. Conventional fare, but fairly priced. But fairly priced. I'm gonna buy all the whiskey I can. We're gonna fix you with alcohol. All right, Swag Damien and Swan Damien. Swan Damien needs two. Unless we get lucky here. Everybody, drink, drink, drink till you're drunk. All right. Uh, Leeds gets us into positive territory. Uh, Torch and Crown, so we got like, it's a really basic area. This is lower our chances of getting those relationships. We're all, we're basically all neutral right now, which is like, I'll take it. That's fine. Where are we going? Each improvement, a new uh, we don't have to fight a boss. That's good. Heat wave fate. and the sprawl is just asking for trouble. Avoid the field hospital. That means we know there's a field hospital. The I'm good with that. Fields of our kingdom. Uh, let's run with do the Wainwright stuff and first. Rot. And then we can look at buying a trinket if there's a good one for us or something. Trinket prices are much lower. Better ranged damage. Um, I keep these for now. But it won't get the candles. I know, not the candles. Anything but the candles. Cry mini Batman, not the candles. Oh, I don't have the money for food. I'm sorry. Somebody's gonna go hungry. 
It's probably gonna be flagged. The dude's fun. He doesn't give a shit about it. He's like, whatever, man. I, whatever. I don't. I don't care. You do what you gotta do. The means of mastery. Thank you for telling me where the hospital is, so I can avoid it. Right? Yeah. All right. We want to upgrade our blights here, especially in this region. Unfortunately, landing the blights here is gonna be rough for us. It's almost even better to go to the sprawl just to not have to deal with it, but. We'll power through. Oh, we also need to swap out. Hold the line for crush. Yeah. We'll power through. I, I promise. It'll be okay. Got to get those numbers up. Up, 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 baby. It's gonna be negative. Yeah. It's much more likely Narrow for it to be negative because they already had one. Fester and Bellow. Two oh, abilities that I'm really awesome. glad that the game is still doing that thing where it's like, hey, um, by the way, we're only gonna pick abilities that you use frequently. And then it goes, I lied, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> and I have to then deal with it. So that's super cool. Thank you, game designers. I like Red Hook. Only character I'm missing right now. Uh, is that the one where it's like uh, the notes on one side with the jester and then the notes on the other side? I can't remember the order of them, so let me know if that's what it is and I'll tell you how to do it. Yeah, fucking mirror one. So yeah, you have to mirror it, right? So um, it has to be... Uh, the first note has to correspond to uh, rank one with rank one, rank two with rank two. Um, you have abilities that will move, uh, change the note. We'll either move the jester, change the note, or swap all of your notes and just change them all. And then you have to rearrange them from there. You basically can only make like one or two mistakes. You kind of have to plan the whole thing out. The jester counts as a wild card. So he can be any of the notes. Um, you just have to put him any position you put him into. He counts as that note on the other side. And then um, the tuning fork uh, indicator means that you've gotten the note right. Um, I think there's three notes, maybe four. I think it's three, though. I think it's the the uh, double eighth, the eighth and the quarter um, note. I can complete the first two phases, not the third. You you can do it. It's always possible. Um, but once you get to that phase, like you have like no stress to work with. That's how they ruin your skill order. Yeah, that's definitely something they need to fix with like the fact you can now rearrange skill order. The fact that it does that, it throws it up to the end. It really sucks. You can do like if you can get through the first two phases, you can do the third phase. It's just really like you can't make any mistakes. You like have you have to like almost plan out every single one of your moves with the amount of stress you have left. And sometimes if you've and if you've gotten your, yourself in a position where you can't do it, like you you can't do it. And that's what Bravo. sucks about that shrine. It's a lot better than it used to be, but that doesn't make it perfect, that's for sure. This road cannot be walked alone. Slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Yoink! Gonna eat the shit out of that corpse. It's okay for me to eat corpses, just not them. You can pretty much play Flag however the fuck you want. That's what I've learned about him. You just kind of have to just play him. Malaise. Measured and steady. Give me my health back. Mmm, yummy. A righteous action. Flag has got to be one of the most fun characters to play, in my opinion. He just, like... He just works really well, no matter how you play him. He's one of the few heroes that I truly do not think need balancing. 
but it gives me hope that they like when they got to the end of the development cycle and they developed like Damien's abilities that they kind of realized what was good and what was bad and that they're with like the occultist changes and then other changes that I'm sure they're going to be working on I think we we might get some really good balance um I think I think it just shows that they like they developed the the heroes as they developed the game and as the game's changed and done all of its stuff it's like it's changed how they um how they the they've wanted to do stuff dwindled. The changes to the occultist are definitely a, a good show of faith about like what they they know they need to change stuff. Flag antiquated is the best combo. Yes, that is modded though. Can't do it. <laughs> Dude, ghost pepper is no joke, turtle. I'm glad you're okay though. That was not the ability I wanted to do. I keep misclicking that for some reason. Whatever. Normal DD2. I'm still having fun with it, so. Man, it's really annoying that they both move forward with that. God, when Necrosis hits like that, it's a good feeling. Yeah, I'm glad I don't. I think you've got a problem if you like those bashes. That's actually, I feel like that'd be easier, though. I feel like that takes away a lot of what a lot of what makes the shambler scary because it can't spawn any tentacles, right? Hello, curing cuppa. More blight, please. I require additional blight. Was double chirogen. Was the fact that they didn't even make the gummy words taste good for you? Yeah, if you're going to make them that spicy, why would you make them taste good? I feel like they don't have any interaction with each other because Wilbur can't create his own combo, can he? Can he? Yeah. No, he can't. I don't think he can mark himself. He has to have one of the... Um, the little skitter, skitty dudes of him. Skitter, the swine whatever the fuck they're called. 2,000 hours in this game. I don't remember what the mobs are called. Uh, I can't afford anything because I'm poor. Well, I say that I can definitely afford some things like a early experiment. All right, game over. Boom. Boom. Game over. Uh, they have an ability called Skitter. That's why I'm thinking of it. Skitty, Skitter, a bunch of other words. Yeah, there's an enemy that has a, an ability called Skitter. Perma healing nonsense. But it can only heal when somebody does damage to a combo enemy, right? I don't know, I'm probably just misremembering something. Alright. The Blight team is ready now. Sorry, are you like... Oh, you're on double Chirogen. Sorry, okay. My bad. Incremental. That makes more sense. Ow. I'm about to say, why is my flag in rank two? I just realized we got, or rank one, we just, we got ambushed. Oh well. A master stroke. I'll give you my master stroke. Oh, hey, it's a schlobby. It is the schlobby nader. Road cannot be walked alone. She's the schlobbiest. Oh, 
Oh, you like that combo token? Well, too fucking bad. You can't have it. And I'll take my health back, thank you. And stab you in the face with some darts. Sounds dark like a good day to me. An unavoidable end. Ooh, 5% additional crit is actually pretty nice. I do like that. With our 4% additional crit from uh the thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna I'm gonna take this. Yeah, I like that. Does what lower healing received? Yeah, that's fine. Should be okay. Unless we get the indelible version of it here. Give me a scouting item though. Another scouting item. That's flapjacks. So doesn't count. Um, honestly though, I will take this. Um, I will probably keep curing Kappa, but for now the piercing is gonna be really nice. Convince me to get a snack. Snacks are good. We like snacks. The scouting griddle pog. Yeah, so this gives us additional piercing, which in this region is really nice. Um, that's really all I care about. It's fine. We can probably switch it back to cut. Wait, that, that does count as noxious right before I go off. Yeah, OK. All right. This means we're guaranteed to land those uh, those blights on region enemies. It is low indeed. indeed. To, to profit, profit in destruction. destruction. Sturdy enemies. Oh boy. They're so chonky. Yeah, that increased crit rate is, is doing some pretty good things for us right now. The fiend's strength dwindles. Not for that. No, no, no. You know crit. I crit. Not for you. No crit for you. Give me all my health back. Thank you. No, I keep misclicking Glenn. God damn it. Oh well, that's gonna hurt. He's fine, everybody's fine. Stay low of examine it. I'm not really worried about the potency, honestly. I just want to land the blights. Like, yeah, you do want you do want to keep him lower if you really want to max out his blights. But we're dealing enough blights, not really a big issue. That gives you uh hit heal yeah, that'd be pretty crazy. Get some gnarly heals. Everybody's feeling a little stressed right now. Take some crack. The best cure. Cut down these nightmares. And I still can't post to Twitter. Uh, you guys didn't know my Twitter account has been locked because it thinks I'm a bot and it's been locked for like over three days and I cannot like post anything or like anything or do anything. And I've messaged support about it multiple times and now they're like not doing anything. So I may just not have Twitter anymore, which is probably a good thing. But also, like, I do actually get a lot of opportunities through Twitter um, for, like, streaming stuff. This so it's kind of unfortunate. The of the familiar, does it not? Shouldn't have been a bot. That, that's true. Shouldn't An have. Unexpected find. Pustule Sal. Those are pretty good. The loathing whispers. You whisper. Shut up. But 
Oh well, alas. Life doth go on. Oh, my homies love pustule salves. Mm. All my homies love driving into the abyss, the never ending death. I don't know. Wow, do you guys think we should go to the cache, the cache, or the cache? Well, I can only go to the cache or the cache. I can't go to the other cache. That cache is out of limits. But the other cache and the other cache, we can do those caches. Those are, those are some pretty cash money caches, not gonna lie. Refreshing commune. It just says it says your account is suspected of being a bot. That's all it tells me. Has been for like over three days. Like I thought it was like maybe I like maybe it's because I I use a thing on my stream deck that like automatically changes my username to British Brad is live when I go live, um, and that maybe it you know it saw that as like an automated thing and that's what it's accusing me of, which is like okay fine I'll just wait like a day. But it's been like three days now and I can't post anything, um, so it's a little unfortunate. A simple choice. At least it should be. Yeah, the, the middle one gives me more options, even though we have to Is take a fight. Prepared for the upcoming obstruction? Is your face prepared for the upcoming fist to it, Wayne? Supplies this way. Sorry, if I'm just being real with you, man. Is it? Oh, goody, another ambush. Love that for us. I mean, thankfully, it's not the worst one we could have gotten, but like. Feeling really useful in this with our flag in position three. Ow. Okay, that's a lot of blight. Okay, I would. I'm just gonna get rid of that blight. Hey, can we not? Like, no really? Can we not? That'd be great. I'd really appreciate that. Let's, like, absolutely, let's not do this. How long have I been a streamer? Since... Oh, God. One sec. Five years. 60 months. Bro, why is the game good about who it needs to focus on? Can you not? What? Come on. Stop changing it up. The smallest variable can make all Game the Game actually trying to kill me here. Like what the fuck? That's not allowed. I got an eight bleed. I got a cure on a character that only has 35 health. Yeah. Intended to. I was about to say, why do I have fester? But I know why I have fester. The fiend's strength dwindles. A steady subtraction, an invariable, an invariable result. result. All right. Man, we used our healing salve, but yeah, you know, that is what it is. My God, what is his resist? It's only forty percent. Like, it's not that high. A calculated generosity, but a welcome one nonetheless. Fucking nervous is really doing overtime for us right now. Okay, this is just getting silly. And okay, finally, we land one. Jesus Christ. A simple kindness. This fight has made me use like all of my items right now. A 
deliberate and methodical appliance of harm. No, thank you. Oh my god, Psycho. <laughs> Dude, have you actually caught a fish, like, at all recently? At this point, I'm just invested in, in this. Eager to ply his trade. Consider all variables. But all right, you guys want to take on the cultist fight, it seems? All right, I'm good for that. I don't really need the Kyrogen stable right now. Caught anything fast. in a while. Frick. Frick. Hey, we got my healing cell back. Thank you. Thank you, video game gods. I appreciate you. Honestly, do I still have anti-venom on right now? No, okay, we're good. We Gucci. All right, we'll go with Damien just because he has the lowest relationships, so. Seem to have fixed most of them, though. Impervious enemies. Love that for us. Games I play on Steam before DD2. Uh, Darkest Dungeon, obviously. Uh, so I used to really be as big on, like, um... Like indie game variety, so I did Hollow Knight, Celeste, Darkest Dungeon, Agony Cuphead, um, uh, originally, like, when I very much started, when I very started, when I very started, when I started streaming, I was doing PUBG, then I did, uh, Dead by Daylight for a while, um, God, I keep misclicking Glint thinking it's flashing, I... I don't know why I keep doing that. It's very annoying. Um, Children of Morta was another one. Yes, I am. I am absolutely that. Children of Morta was a really fun one. What else have I played on stream? I mean, I've played a lot of games on stream. As far as games that we've completed, I think I have a list in my About Me somewhere. Um... of games that I've played on stream. Yeah, I want to get back into doing a bit more variety stuff. I really like DD2, don't get me wrong, but um, I, I started streaming because I really, well, not I started streaming, but I really got into wanting to explore new games and stuff. See what other indie titles, Monster Train, Slay the Spire. Those are other ones as well. I really want to check out Inscription. I've got Dungeons 4 that I'm going to play. Um, so I'm playing Dead Space you make. I thought I was hallucinating. Yeah, I try not to fall asleep to people playing horror games because I can wake up like in the weirdest fucking like situations. Like what the fuck is going on right now? Nope, that is not what the ability I want. Lethality writ large. Lots of crit tokens. Mistimed, misdirected. Enemy weakens and wanes. Nice crit. Still gonna get off a nice crit itself, but then and 
we can bolster here to get rid of some of the stress. Alright, not bad. Grace. Small acts that drive back the darkness. Um that'll give us a three heal. Sorry, I got something stuck in my eye. Uh, that's three out of the way. <laughs> a lesson taught is a lesson learned. Uh, I'm fine with either of these going away. The loathing whispers. Ah. All right, another fight. The worst kind of parasite. Opportunist. Hello. Been a while. The antiquarian wants what we have, and she will not be denied. It's been a while, my fair lady. It has been a while. All right, let's see. Let's see what kind of damage we can get up to. I'm just going to go ahead and heal him up. Even though he does do better at low health, I just want him to not die, like, super quick. She's already... Oh, no, she. Sorry. That's, uh, that was the crack shot. I got them mixed up. She moved back. Right, I'm just gonna go ahead and bolster. Dead. Three of us resisted that. Fantastic. Love that for us. Just gonna go ahead and do this. Get rid of that stress. Um Yeah, we'll just throw the big blight here. 14, and that one's dead. He's dead. We can stand fast off the combo. Not that we really need to. And then we can do this. I still heal there. You can do protect me all you want. They ain't gonna live anymore. I think she. I think she really could benefit from having a heal. Doesn't it doesn't need to be a strong heal. Just like a little. Just like a little something something. Keep her because she, she had a heal in the first game, you know. The smallest variable can make all the difference. She's definitely caused more stress than I would like. Two minutes of it. Get those dance emotes out.
Dance your little hearts out there. GG's. A simple kindness. It's all so stressed. I need to chill out with the stress. Unfortunately, he gets healed there. Right back to where he was with even more death tokens because that's how this game works. Hmm. I love Hall of Vessel spam. It's my favorite. It's a fun and fair and balanced ability. Oh, there we go. Hint to the home, at least helping us a little bit there. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. Ah, critical hollow vessel. Thank you for the fucking shit ton of stress that that gave me. Again, a fun, fair, and balanced ability that everybody loves. Nobody dislikes that ability. You'd be silly to dislike it. I wouldn't mind Hollow Vessel if he used any other ability on a regular basis. Snap Judgment, hello. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take that. You bet your sweet peppy I'm taking that. The loathing whisper. All right. Have that. Hmm. We need to buff your speed. It can be done, though. Could also give it to Damien. He would also actually benefit from Snap Judgment. He might actually benefit more from it because of his speed right now. Where you go to Act Boss is maddening. Yeah, it's just like... Again, I don't mind it as an ability, but it it's like three stress with six like dot damage and it can be used every turn. It's just a lot, dude. C what? What's that question mean? <laughs> oh, you mean like checking my items? Yeah, no, we're at the end. Familiar heart. Crackles inviting ah, slow handed. Again. Love that for us. Really good. Yeah, I'll take those candles, just so I can throw them on the fucking floor. Nobody likes candles. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Must we have a scouting item, which we do not. Sorry, I'm dropping the flapjacks. Um, all right. the means of mastery. Where are we going? Everywhere in ruin. I guess Everywhere we're going to the sprawl. In need. It's fine. Right. 
conventional fare, but fairly priced. Um, there's some pretty cheap baubles here. Honestly, like, we should take these gnarly knuckles. Or trink uh, trinkets uh, cheap trinkets, baubles. I should say. Paid for in blood. Like, that's better than that for us. Um... We do have some stimulating poultices. This will definitely help us with the eye. Um, I haven't been collecting any shimmering powder. I don't even know if I've missed any. I may have missed some. Book of Creative Insults is also like a pseudo way of dealing with it, kind of. Guess we can get the whiskey while we're here and just see what relationships we might be able to fix. On the road to damnation. Is anybody off by a threshold that we can make? I have three. Barristan and Damien we can get up. And since they've rolled negative relationships in the past, they're more likely to keep rolling it unless we can get them off the threshold. So that's good. And nobody else is close to a threshold. Damien and Swan, sure. Might get a double and something crazy might happen, but it's doubtful. All right, I am going to go to the restroom and stretch out a little bit. My back is starting to give me some issues, so I'm going to go do that. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to run an ad. You're not missing any gameplay or anything like that. Um, it just helps out uh, the channel and also stops pre-rolls from playing for a while for some other people, so... Use this as a chance to go take care of yourself, go do your self-care, get something to drink, stretch out, uh, go to the bathroom, whatever the case is, and I will be right back. So, see ya in a little bit, chat. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this is ridiculous! You get, like, a weird whiff of something, and then it, like, changes the taste of something immediately. I think I just, like, got a whiff of something. Probably a fart. I'm basically just constantly pumping them out anyway. Oh my god. Yes, you are. Shelby agrees. I just fart constantly. I don't even know that it's happening anymore, if I'm entirely honest. No! God damn it. This is stupid. This is just the luck mechanic. This seems like a very boring fight. Oh. Huh? Huh? Was, uh, was that supposed to happen? What did I just do? What? Okay. All right, let's go see what Blight Town's all about. Like my hard souls, but whatever. Oh, that was probably a bad idea, huh? <laughs> where was I keeping that? Where, where, where was that stored? You know what? Don't answer that question. I don't. <clears throat> don't want to know, actually. Don't get hit. That's it. That's it. Don't get hit. Won't die. Got it. All right. Unblinking entropy, at least. Come on. You owe me that. Past is gone. Let it die. The eyes of the void. Fucking good trick. Fuck you, game. Are you fucking kidding me? I didn't even know you could get two ganders. Fuck. That was a shanking, yeah. We shanked him so hard that he forgot how to live. Which I guess is kind of a common out outcome of getting shanked, but like we really we really gave it to him, you know. Go like and subscribe. That's what we call in the content creation world a call to action or a CTA. And that's when I tell you guys that y'all bitches if you don't go to my tweet and like it. A little chunky, a little chunky banana. Oh, my banana is so thick. Uh. You like my sack, though? I think I've got a really nice sack. I think, like, if you were to look at me, you'd be like, that's the nicest sack on a dude I've ever seen. Oh, and we got Shattered Will. Goody, goody, fucking goddamn gumdrops. It's gonna be, it's gonna be glorious. We're gonna stab him in the fucking face until they're fucking dead. And we're gonna just keep stabbing him until they're fucking dead. Ah, oh, it's a shit flare. Yay! Dude, what is wrong with my highwayman? You have so much dodge. Just dodge something. Thank you. Shit. Oh, God. Oh, no, not my shaft. Oh.
You ever look like this after somebody just gets your shaft? <laughs> I don't know what made that noise. I'm just gonna. How do I do damage to him? Mm -hmm. That's. Well, I spent a lot of time making that work, and then it broke. So that's that's amazing. Where is the channel point redeem? Oh, you're a terrible person. Oh, there's no cooldown. Why? Why is there no cooldown? Right. I want to. I want. When I'm done with playing all the Souls games, when I finish Elden Ring, I'm not gonna do Sekiro in this. I want to get to the end and be like, that's why everybody says Dark Souls 2 sucks. Then I can be like part of the. Then I can understand it, right? Um. But then if I don't do it and I play all the other games and then people are like, yeah, but my favorite is not Dark Souls 2 because X. I'm like, I don't fucking know because I'm a little baby bitch and I skipped it. Um, I'm not, you're not a sk And then he has a coughing fit. Yeah, die, old man. <laughs> fucking nerd. <laughs> Hang on. Tell him I'm gaming. Give me all your monies. That's actually all I care about. I don't value any of you as human beings. I only value you for your money and your ability to pay me. And if you can't subscribe to me, get the fuck out of my channel. I don't even want you. All right. All right. Um. I have so many baubles. I feel like I don't have anything to spend baubles on. Like, now I've got all my trinkets. Do I really need... Bubbles for like anything. Not really. Alright. Ari's over here just fishing out the storm. Hey, they're in love! While the heart still beats, desire will never Poison die. Dart will heal 10%. That's great. I wish I had that in the final fight. That would be fantastic. I don't really know what my plan is for the final fight. I don't think I really have one. Behold, the great cities of Man. Save it a couple days. Hell yeah. Ruined and a flame. My goal for this region is to just get through it with as few fights as possible. Really, we've already kind of hit everything we need. I don't really need Terror mastery. I don't really need trinkets. Probably want to try to make sure we get some torchlight. I've been pretty bad about avoiding the assistance encounters and getting in the low light situations, so. Make sure that we have a few of those, hopefully further up here that we can go to. There's, there's one or two. Your path lies through them, and so they must fall. Right. Well, we gotta take the fight, so we take the fight. Two Whippers, Reaver, and a Immolatist, or Flayer. I call these guys Reavers. I don't know where I'm getting that from. Do that, and that'll let us get through with the, the Blight. Weakens and wanes. Really? Fire rises right into him, of course. God, what the fuck is up with the resist right now? Craziness. Like, their resists are 20, and they resisted multiple in a row. Kill him before he goes. Of course, he ignites. He's trying to heal up some of the Agony dots before he takes him. Oh, 
slow dissection. An unavoidable right. Easy peasy. Amidst the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Mmm. No. If I was using Courageous Abandon, maybe, but I'm I'm not. The loathing abates. Um I'm gonna go for the cash. I don't really need it, but I do need to think about going to an assistance encounter. Cause uh the torchlight will get pretty low with us avoiding stuff. Thankfully, our loathing isn't super high right now, so it won't go up too crazy. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these well-worn relics. Uh, don't really need much else there. Everyone wants to go for the question mark. We still got the watchtower, so that's fine. And it's an assistance or a, a academic study. Broken clock. Uh, I mean, who knows? We could get we could get extra actions out of it. I don't really have any great stun resist. I don't think I have a clarifying poultice, do I? I do have a clarifying poultice, so maybe we can get some extra actions. On guard, on guard's good too. In this world, Fuddling Sundial, I'm not touching it. Without purpose. Not a fan of befuddling Sundial. The two stress is too hard to deal with, personally. Just too much. We are about to take two more loathing though going this way, so that sucks. That's gonna drain our torchlight much faster. Down to 53. Festers. We kind of have to take this fight, probably. We do get a little torchlight at the cult fight here. Shambler's altar. Oh god. <sighs> uh, not a shambler. I don't know, man. I don't know if I can do a shambler. How did my torchlight go up? We're at 54. We were at 53. That's weird. God, of course, two people want to leave right now. Ugh. All right, we'll get some torchlight from this cult cultist fight. We can't skip, so we have to go to it. And then hopefully we can go to the assistance encounter after. I think the Shambler will give us full torchlight afterwards, which is a nice thing, too. Oh, we're still on an ad break. Wait, what? Wait, was, is that a different ad than the one I played when I was going to the bathroom? What is going on? Or is it the same ad? It's got to be the same ad, but that was not three minutes, I guess. I thought the ad was over. I'm bad. I'm I bad. Whoops. Oh, well. Just keeping the stress down at this point. Okay, he's dead.
Keep dodging. Get the execution there. All right. And we keep going. Cultist fight next. Should at least get us a bit more torchlight. Should be good. Also lower our loathing by one. I don't know, man. We'll see how we feel about going up against the Shambler. I'm not super liking the idea. It's not the best team to take to a Shambler fight. Let's just, I'll just be real. Like, it can work, definitely. As long as we're landing the Blights, it'll be okay. But landing the Blights in the Shambler fight can be definitely a easier said than done. Good dodge there. God damn it. I think it's dead. Yeah. A master stroke. Nice crit. go psycho you caught something yay it's not patronizing at all We should go for the kill here. This one could do Nocturne. Yeah. That's better than eating a crit. A petty hindrance. An inkling of potency still uh, lingers Don't care about these. Well I mean, dodge ready. actually could be good for us. Like, dodge tanking the final boss is definitely an option, but it's the not Lord really one I want to play around with. We haven't run into the collector, which I'm kind of surprised about, considering the fact we've had him for we've had this head for three regions, but. did not pre-shuffle. We have to take the fight. <laughs> That's funny. We get vulnerable because of Death Seeker. All right. We have no choice but to take the fight. I didn't pre-shuffle. That's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Um, Caltrops here are pretty good. That. And Pustral Salve will be good as well. All right. Well... It's that time, ladies and gents. The torch is low. Rat is a gambler. The With this chant, we summon the, the shambler. A shambling <laughs> Just gonna shuffle us right again. Okay, that could have been a much worse shuffle, I suppose. Weaken them, that another may finish the work.
Yeah, the big issue is going to be landing the blights on, on the Shambler itself. Like, that's going to be our problem. Do we need, we need those to land in order to actually do any fucking damage to this thing. Um... And it's got a pretty, it's got a 50% chance to resist him. So like, we're not off to a great start with that. That's still alive? Oh shit. I guess that actually works out for us, it's fine. Oh, come on, even with the crits? Come on, game. Cunning. You may outwit them yet. Yeah, we're still getting a good amount of light there. 24 is no joke. what I need to see. Alright, we got it. The enemy weakens and wanes. Fortunately, I don't think I'll be able to kill it before it... Well, well actually, I think we will. That daze came in clutch. Hell yeah. Alright. All right, unblinking entropy, please. For the love of God, can I finally get unblinking entropy? I don't think it exists in the game anymore. I think I think unblinking entropy is a fever dream we all had that no longer exists. Um, this can go well on flag. It really can, except I don't care enough to put it on him. So, nope. Sorry. I'll take the two mastery though, sure. The loathing abates. I've not seen Unblinking Entropy in a very long time. I... Brace up. Oh, I meant to go for... Well, we've got 100 for Torchlight from that, so that's fine. I want to go to the Hospital Locking Cosmic Slayer. This should be fine. We should be able to recover on this fight decently well. Frenzied Enemies does not a happy camper make me. A brilliant conclusion. I mean, the regen's nice. And a nat crit, just to, we did get the regen additional on there, so that's good, I guess. But you guys, you got, you got to chill. You got you guys. Come on, man. Ah, oh, this game is so dumb sometimes. Fuck it. Man, that hit hard, dude. Deliberate and methodical appliance. Oh, that should have been enough to kill. Oh, god damn it. Uh, he could die here. That didn't count as a that's weird. That should have definitely counted as a, a tick on death's door. I don't know why it didn't. Not complaining, obviously, but
This wound, at least, has been tended to. mad for not using cauterize and then yeah despite not having a bleed yeah they said that they fixed that multiple times now i've heard that many many times I, I truly do think they've just got some like running bug that they just cannot figure it out i think that, i think it's just a bug that they just have not been able to like get the root cause of well, we were able to recover on that fight, but that was not fun. I say recover. I mean, we have more health and less stress than we did earlier. So, like, you know, that's that's recovery in my eyes. Nope. Come on. Come on, game. We're doing our money. That's 68 relics. It's plenty of relics. Malachian Cosmic Slayer, um, just because it is such a potently good uh, quirk. If we can manage to survive the eye, it would be really good for us to keep. On Guard is also something I would really like to keep as well. Okay. A lot of money we just dropped on that, but I think that's worth it. Uh, it's not a scouting item. If it was a scouting item, I would take it. Just to increase our crit chances even more. Another hospital, no thanks. Question. I'm good. Well, Only the I say that. To get there. Um, it's a, it's not a fight. I mean, we have a non-skippable fight after it, but that should be okay. I don't really care about the hospital itself. I just care about getting the exemplar in decent shape. Have a lot of items for not she having like a rummager on our team. Of her work, but undertakes it nonetheless. Greater cleansing sensor. Um, I mean, not getting the debuffs from the eye is going to be huge as well. Yeah, sure. Like, not getting the, the, the stuns or the dazes or whatever is going to be pretty good for us. All right, we've got a fight before Exemplar. It's just make it an easy one, hopefully. What is it? It is a pillager fight. Hopefully not an antiquarian. I probably just put that in the world, though. Oh, just a regular pillager fight. And a badly organized one at that, so that's nice. Supposed to dodge, my friend. Come on. Come on. Sorry. All right, Early I'll take that. Are encouraging. How did that do one damage? Does she have a weakness token? Is it really one to three on that? For some reason, I thought it was more. I don't know why I thought it was more. I just like... Weird. Obviously, I thought wrong.
Sorry, I'm reading a comment on my YouTube video right now. Okay, or it would be if my studio would actually be loading. Alright, anyway, um, yeah, it's about as good as this fight's gonna get. Let's go. As long as he's not super blight heavy resi- Oh, he's not even ordained, alright. Well, that should make this fairly easy. The blight resist is still 40, though. It's not- It's like the weakest blight resist in the world. They both resist to that, that's great. Fine, as long as you dodge the next one, you know. On Act Three, you pretty much have to focus down him. Like you, you can't ignore it because of the taunt. The dodge. Thank you. for you. Doesn't like that ability for whatever reason. Malaise. Measured and steady. GG. Three rounds. Well, four technically. Not too shabby. Amidst the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Misstep is very good, but I don't really care about it that much. Healing received from skills is also very good. Um, I don't think it's going to help us that much. That regen is actually better for us. If we can get the regen, the proc on him, and he has tokens on him, it'll be a lot better. I am I am pretty worried about this, though. I, I don't think we're going to do super well against this fight, just because we don't have a great way of dealing with the scene tokens, like to move them, to remove them, anything like that. We can kind of use... Um, you can use... Uh, the Grave Robber's ability on this fight, her corpse ability, because there are corpses on this fight, but... The fire is lit. The table is set. The inn awaits its favorite guests. I read Damien as Dismas, and I was very confused. Uh, I'll take these. I'll take that, sure. These are all blocked by Malophobic, so I can't do anything with them, fortunately. Can be taught that you may stand just a little taller at the end. I'm 
I'm just giving her something in case somebody dies. Us of a time before the end. Okay, the 10 is gonna be the risky one here. I wish we could know about it. Nothing here that I want. There's no traveling item or scouting items. Could try to get rid of nervous. Might be a good idea. Oh, I can't afford it. All right, whatever. Screw it. We go. There is nothing for it now but to press on. All right, let's see if we can do it. Act three. Oh, that was supposed to be a, a go. But alas, it was not. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Hopefully we get some good relationships here. Amorous, okay. The heart still beats, Amorous on Fester, not so much. Die. And Battle Heal, also not so much, but it is what it is. There's some dodges and stuff out of this. All right. We'll take it. All right, y'all. Here we go. To the mountain we go. At last, the great ziggurat. Temple and wrap it all off. Regret. Um. Oh, did I not have this bot open? No, one sec. I'm looking at the wrong thing. I did have that bot open. It's just... Alright. We're gonna do a game giveaway. To close out the stream, so... I'm gonna open a giveaway. Exclamation enter if you'd like a chance to win a free Steam key. We'll have that going until the run is over. Whether it's good or bad, we're going to do it. Just the thanks to everybody who's watching to the end. Got some games that go up. I've got one game right now that's like $80 MSRP on my Steam key list, so never know what you're going to get. Let's make quick work of this, shall we? Uh, we'll put a little bleed resist up here and... Is the key. A brilliant conclusion. Excellent. I wonder if we can kill this guy before it's able to get, uh, they're able to get their warship off here. Probably not. If we can get him to death's door, I just need to go faster than somebody else and we'll be good. All right, we're good. We got him. Mm, it's a shame he didn't dodge that. But we do get the regen on that, so yeah, that's whatever. Snap judgment with the crit. Crit token there. Thank you. Relief comes rarely in these times. Hell yeah. Everybody get in on that game giveaway. You never know. It could be something juicy. Ow. 
Stop, you're resolved. bad at defusing the bomb, Swan. Alright. Do we have another fight? I can't remember. This is the first one you get to. Oh, yeah, we do have another fight. Alright, that's fine. I can never remember which one they start doing the two fights on. Well, that was nice while it lasted. Wasn't it lovely? You are hella good at roulette. That is true. You do have that going for you. Oh my god. The fiend's strength dwindled. GG. Swan wins that one. Bravo. Goodbye. Shit's fixed. I don't know. Maybe Swan's just really that good. It's all about skill with that, uh, that dueling game, you know? A master stroke. These crits are fucking great. I love this. That heals him this and gets the dodge. It's just a funny situation because of the relationship. Inadvertent healing. Let's cure off some of that stress. So I don't go into this fight absolutely wrecked. Malaise. I think 24 Blight is enough to get the message across here. A little help impeccably timed. All right, all. Final fight. Let's see if we can do it. I hope we can. We got some good heroes here. I'd rather not just die immediately to this fight, but it, it frustrates me to no end, this fight, so. We shall have to see. We really don't have any great items for this either, so. All right. Act three, Obsession. You're still alive? You are still alive. We'll see if you're still alive after this fight. Assuming we can land the Blights, we should be okay, right? Don't laugh at me, Mariner. Is revealed. Don't do it. Beyond it's rude. Only infernal don't be, don't be kick W in all over me. Eyes. Doth my eyes deceive me? Got rid of two eye stalk levels, so they'll get they both get rid of their turn. Yeah, what's up, penguin? How you doing, bud? Get the trick to the eye. Oh no, I thought they would both get rid of their turn. They did not. I lied. Uh, the trick to the eyes is uh, questioning every decision you've made in your life about how you play this game, and realizing that you don't know what the hell you're doing. And that's how you play the eyes. Pretty much. A slow dissection. 
just watch two ads. Gotta love that. Yeah, that one's turns done. That one's dead. We may get through this with only getting the taunt tokens on the one, so that's good. Depending on how this all pans out here. We got rid of one, all right. Excellent. There's another. That's gonna grow. Oh no, it didn't grow. That's fine. Okay, that one's dead. Strength dwindles. It's going well, man. Just trying to get through this fight. Oh, I still have Fester on. I did not mean I still have that on. Whoops. Oh. Hope we don't need any other abilities. Now he's gonna he's guaranteed to take a crit here, so I'm actually kinda wanting to have him do the killing of this eye. Another if we can line it up to take off at least one of the tokens. As unlikely as that might be. That's him growing up. No, okay, he didn't grow up. Okay, so I basically want to pass around until I can get the mana arms to do the damage here. Um, I'm going to do something. I'm going to pass. I'm going to take the stress here. And we're going to go... We're guaranteed to kill here. That'll remove one scene token, which means that he at least won't get crit immediately, which is good. If he has that many scene tokens on him, he gets automatic. It's an automatic crit on Limerence. So now it's not. What's the blight resist? 40% blight resist. All right. Works some magic, hopefully. Malaise. Measured and steady. Okay. Will the real Slim well, okay. He just gave himself the last token that he needs. Hey, Slim, how's it going, man? So he's going to take crits here. There's really nothing we can do about it. Oh, that... Come on, you got to dodge that, buddy. You got to dodge that. Oh, this... Yeah. Thanks for taking all those dodge tokens. The guaranteed crit. And the next one will also be a guaranteed crit. I'm going to go ahead and give him this to give him additional death door resist, and then we're just going to stand fast here. <clears throat> just going from work. Hopefully work was good for you. An opportunity squandered. Okay, 15. The crits. Love that for us. He has two block tokens, so he should be able to take this damage. Dodge it. Come on! You've got dodge plus, dude! Fuck! Res resolute? Oh my god. Alright, that's just fucking annoying. He stole the dodge plus, too. So, hey. Peel off the dodge tokens at least. All marks of the unprepared. All right, this is about to get this is about to get a little wacky here. Fuck jobs, absolutely agree. Thankfully, he can apply dots, so we actually live through this. We get a block plus token, which is great. I'm going to go ahead and stand fast, though. Uh, it's, turn it's turning it around on us pretty heavily right now. Hey, 
the regen is great though. Hints of home doing the absolute fucking beast of a job. But it's now gotten rid of all, all of the blight that was on it. Uh, what did I miss? Did I miss something? Oh, two days into new position, 22 hours clock, my job is being eliminated. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. They gave you a new role just to eliminate it? That means it's time to leave. <laughs> Can you not dodge this move? Can it not be dodged? It might not be dodgeable. Maybe that's what it is. If it's not dodgeable, then that's that's a whole thing. I I didn't even realize if it isn't or is not. All right, I'm only gonna do this to keep us to keep him from dying immediately from an immediate attack here. I'm really glad that Behold can trigger the regen though. That's really nice to know. Slow Warp plays so low before it's a say you need, yeah, it sounds like you need, okay, I don't think you can dodge suppress. No, no dodge tokens are going away. Got it. Okay. Yeah, it sounds like you need to get the fuck out of there, honestly, man. Because that's really rough. Fuck yes! Get out of here! Ooh, get the fuck out of here, big boy. Hints of home actually coming in clutch there. Regen is so clutch in this fight. Pretty high until we just like, I mean, yeah, it just sounds terrible. If they're gonna do stuff like that, I can imagine this bad all around. Oh. That was that was pretty good, man. I'm glad we're able to. Oh God. Um, all right, who wins? Get on my level, Swan. Ooh, all right. That was good. That was good. I'm glad we we're able to get an Act Three victory out of the way. Um, that's pretty good. Ooh. A little a little nail biting there, but nothing that we can't handle because we're just that fucking cracked at the video game. Okay. Yeah, thank you. I am. Yeah, it's see, okay, he agrees. I am that cracked at the video game. You're actually right. Don't fucking don't don't laugh at me. No, no jokes here, only truth. Only the truth. Alright, we're gonna go see if we can find somebody to raid. If you're not already for the best of reviews, I love it. I need to add more memes. Um, if you're not already following here, do consider following. I generally stream Darkest Dungeon 2 four days a week. I also stream Dark Souls 2. Next week, we're probably going to stream some different games. I want to try branching out a little bit more again, uh, playing some other indie titles that I haven't taken a look at in a while. Um, but yeah, and if you're also not subscribed to the YouTube, you can find all my VODs there. You can find all my other videos. If you are watching this video on YouTube, thanks for watching. Do consider subscribing to the channel if you're not already, so you can catch all this great content. And let's 